is up guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Brian Quattro, and yeah, welcome, welcome to another video. Uh, yeah, as always guys, before we get started, please smash that like, please subscribe guys, my channel has been growing, uh, I've just been loving it guys, like thank you for all of the new subscribers who have come along, who have joined the channel, and who are tuning in every video guys, I really do appreciate it, and I've just been loving doing every last bit of this. Like I said in the last video, guys, I'm gonna be doing like a little bit of a paranormal video today. Um, I'm gonna go up to a cemetery that actually me and my friends used to come up and do like a lot of ghost hunting and like EVP sessions in a lot when we were like we were younger when we were back in school and college and everything. So the cemetery has always kind of creeped us out. It's like the main cemetery in Bozeman, and it's just really old. It has a lot of history, and um, it's just always like we've always been drawn to it. So. I'm gonna come here, and it's actually my first time ever using the Necrophonic app, and uh, it, it's been widely used by a lot of like my favorite ghost hunters on YouTube, um, Kelsey Davies, Mackie Albertson, Chris Starr, Mosarji. They all use this app, and uh, <coughs> they've honestly had some really cool results. So I'm really stoked to go try it. Um, so I'm gonna mob up to that cemetery right now and get it done. And I'm all by myself, so guys, I'm a little freaked out, but. You know, I want to get this video, I want to get some good content for you guys, so let's do this. Alright guys, so needless to say, I'm really creeped out. I'm gonna try not to shine this in my face because I can't see anything. I'm gonna find like a really old spot, guys. It's 2007. Okay, this area is kind of drawing me. This is what I'm talking about. This is like the old areas right here. realize guys if my phone if, my, if this light dies I forgot my other light so I have to dip out of here if this light dies is there anybody here with me right now Is there anybody here that wishes to communicate with me? What's the name on the grave I'm standing next to? What? Sit. What's the name of the grave I'm standing next to? Spring is creeping me out, guys. 
what we just re What's the name on this grave right here? communicate with me right now? I'm sorry that I'm looking around, but this is the only light I have, so I have to like look around with the camera to see. You did not just say behind me. No, you did not. Yo. What's behind me? Whoa, uh-uh. Whoa. Did you just say my name? Yes. I just got chills. Say my name again. If you can say my name, what's the name on this grave? No, 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 no. All right, since you know my name, you know the name of the grave. What's my nickname? No. Well, there's my name. Do you know my nickname? What's the name on the grave I'm in front of right now? What's the name of the grave I'm in front of right now? If you know anything about me, what's my mom's name? What's my mom's name? Did you say Adams? It's her first married name. Well, 
What's the name of my really good friend who passed away? Dude, no, 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 you just, no. Guys, I'm out of here. That's what the, oh my God, guys. It just said Brandon, which is the name of my really good friend who passed away a couple years ago. Do you guys know him? You guys know the name of the person who's causing me a lot of emotional pain right now? abruptly end that guys they do ticket people in that park or for being like in that park after hours um we have been busted for that before um so as soon as i saw those headlights dude i was gone like i had that big light like there's no way they weren't gonna see that or they didn't see that like they're literally like on the next road anyways so yeah i had to book it out of there and um but guys that was that was freaky like seriously like i honestly don't know how much of that like i had left in me anyways like it was giving me all positive answers um the last one, like, I'm not sure if I'm really gonna leave that in there because I don't really know if I want that person to see that, like, the person's name who was mentioned in that. I don't really know if I want them to see, like, that at all. But, like, I don't know, guys, that's really heavy. Like, that was not what I was expecting at all. Um, I saw a lot of people use this app and on like videos and, like, I just, I was, I was a skeptic, guys. Like, I've been a skeptic of Randonautica, I've been a skeptic of everything, and, uh, Guys, that was really creepy. Like, I'm not gonna lie. It said the names of the graves that I was I was next to, and I do apologize if you know for putting any of those names on there. But I do feel like that's a benefit of like this like investigation and everything like that of this video. And that that was just crazy. It said my name, um, said my mom's name, said the name of the person who's been causing me a lot of emotional stress lately, and uh, it was freaky, guys. So let me know if you guys like this video. Uh, I do want to do more of these types of videos like I've always been into like paranormal investigations and everything so please let me know what you guys think as always guys please smash that like please subscribe please leave a comment please hit that little bell for all those notifications guys I really do appreciate you guys helping me grow the channel and like I said guys I've really been having a lot of fun doing this and make sure you guys follow me on all my other forms of social media stay updated on what I'm doing and just you know follow me along for the ride love to hear from you guys too so stay in contact guys until next time I'm out Oh,